Here is lesson 29 for trumpet. We will play le uh, numbers 69 and 70. All right, there's lots of information on this page, isn't there? Yes, we have dotted half notes. We have our new time signature. And we have dynamics. Okay, you know all of this already because you've already looked through it before starting this video. You've already looked through and you know that your dotted half notes get three beats each. You know the three four time signature means that there are three beats in the measure and each quarter note gets a beat. Now, we're going to play number 69 and you'll buzz it with me. First note, buzz it. Here we go. One, ready. Did you repeat? If you did, good! That means you already looked through and you noticed that repeat and you marked what you needed to so you wouldn't forget it. Alright, before we move on to number 70, let's talk about our code phrase. It is concert pitch. Okay? So, when we play a concert B flat, that's a C for us. But the concert pitch what you hear, the pitch, is a B flat. All right, now let's move on to number 70. Okay, again, you should have already worked through it, practiced it, you should know how it goes. So buzz it while I play it. Here's your first note. Here we go, one, ready. Did you play the correct dynamics? Did you tap your foot? Did you count? Hope you didn't forget about that. All right now, we're going to play 70 one more time, and we're going to play it at a tempo that I want us to be able to play it. We'll play this in one. Now, what does it mean when I say we're going to play something in one? Instead of one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, we now get one beat per measure. One, two, three, one. One, one, two, three, one. Just like that. So let's try it. Bum, 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 bum. Ready. <laughs> If not, then you can practice it a little bit. But that's your goal for that piece. That was lesson 29. Thank you for joining me.